My name is Jimmy Anderson. I'm a director producer of The Prey. I've been working in Cambodia since 2011. I'm working on many different feature films. I've done uh, five, five movies. The highlights of my career so far has been uh, Jailbreak that was made in um, 2016. Thanks to Jailbreak that led me to make The Prey, this new movie that's now coming out on the cinema. The Prey is a story about a wealthy man they can do everything with their money. And so they, they decide to um, come to this place and to uh, make a deal with the warden of this prison. So my name is Lotte, I'm the associate producer on The Prey. So my role on The Prey was working with Jimmy very early uh, on the stage of development, uh, on the script when it came time to prepare for the shoot, like working on all the logistics, the casting, making sure that everything was prepared in terms of the accommodations for the shoot, since most of the shoot happened outside of the city. <laughs> Further than that, once the shooting was done, it, um, helping make sure the film goes to post-production and gets finished so we can bring it to international sales. So my role has also been involved in the sales, uh, helping to release the film here in Cambodia with film markets and uh, others. We wanted to do something that um, could be labeled as a, uh, a local film going uh, international with, with the feel of being an, an international film. So back in 2017, I went into China, spent a few months in China looking for the actors, and, and I found Mr. Gu Shenwei. and with Thailand, I already worked with uh, uh, Pu Vitaya, who played the warden in the film, and he mentioned to me, uh, okay, I have some, some other friends that you should consider, and I met the, the, the rest of the cast. What an amazing 28 days in the kingdom of Cambodia. Uh, when I accept uh, the offer to be here, I didn't really expect uh, that this project would be so much fun and and the journey would be such an experience. So I ที่ชื่อพยักษ์ผมขอให้ทุกท่านนะครับติดตามเรื่องนี้แล้วก็หวังว่าทุกท่านจะสนุกด้วยครับพวกเราขอบคุณครับ so, so this is your first time filming in Cambodia. It is. And uh, and you would say you're having quite a, that's quite a positive experience. Oh, for sure. Yeah. I mean, um, everybody here is very enthusiastic, and uh, I think uh, they're doing quite a good job. I mean, no no problems there. So. They're making it, uh, making it, making it easy on us. Mm -hmm. I've been shot. I've been shot. Mm -hmm. I've been shot. What am I gonna do? Yeah. Oh, oh mother won't, mother won't. <laughs> this is my first time get to drive a Ferrari. Uh, I'm not sure what model it is, but it's my first time in that. Super, super car and um, new experience. And even though I didn't know how to maneuver it in the beginning, but um, I got the hang of it. So 
So when it came to casting, like we actually called back a lot of actors that we were used to working with before. Uh, that included like Rosemary, Wendy Pissette, Bruce Long, Dara U, and uh, as well as uh, Disonita, which all of them actually worked on Jailbreak as a cast or a crew on it. Yeah, but I know action Very early on on the project, like we knew we wanted to work with Jean Paul Lee again to to design the action scenes in the film. Uh, we originally we were thinking of him having a role in the film as well. Uh, but when the cast got confirmed and we had such international cast and we had to be more careful with the safety, JP preferred to have a role on off camera, being behind and making sure that the action scenes are always executed properly, that the safety is always there for everyone. Hi, uh, we are doing the prep for the fall for the gang master fight. So this is like the old Hong Kong you know, like era of, uh, of stunt prep, boxes. Come in. Rear, rear, rear. Come this way, so there's like, I think, 10 from this way. Alright. From here, you have a view of the whole, whole height. It's gonna fall from the first floor over there. We're gonna make it very safe. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. All right, this is day two on the shoot. Um, we are shooting, uh, we frosting all the windows because this is supposed to be a Beijing police headquarters uh, nap and nap time. All right, let's roll sound, please. Let's roll cameras. So why do you need to record them uh, separately like that? From I need the the, I need to record the, the uh, cricket ambience because during the shot it was it was not the same ambience and now the cricket move from the trees like that. So I need to chase the cricket to have the same sound to edit after. Mm -hmm. yeah. And uh, and also um, why do you need to record the breath and everything? Because I need, I need all the sound okay. separately to edit after. I need to decompose the to decompose the sequence. You know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. Some maintain Moltusan and Ruin, the prey, Tangok near, some Okun. <laughs>